Hey, yo, it's me, Carlos C. Happy 4th of July, right? Right, Macho Man? Happy 4th of July. What are you guys doing today? Did you get illegal fireworks? It can blow something up. Let me know in the description what your 4th of July is looking like. Today, we are a bit tired. Some would say exhausted. Yesterday, we shot an awesome event, a quinceanera, and it was so much fun. It, there was so much going on. A lot of really great memories captured, and I can't wait to start editing the video. We didn't want to stay at home for this 4th of July because it sounds like a war zone in front of my house, in front of the apartment on 4th of July, and we didn't... Like yeah, a lot of people like it. We don't want any of that smoke, especially because this one doesn't quite know what an M80 sounds like middle of the night, so and they do it until like 3, 4 in the morning. We ain't trying to do all that. We took a drive last night, went home, packed up after the event, and uh, we drove until we couldn't drive no more. And uh, that's exactly what we did. We, where did we land? We're in Iowa. <laughs> We're in something called Mundelein, Iowa. Moline. Moline. But anyway, what do we do here in Moline, Iowa? I've never been here. I was actually trying to make it to Grand Rapid, um, Iowa. No chill yesterday. Today we woke up like there was a train wreck. I feel like I got hit by a car. Uh, and then we jumped in the pool. My wife woke us up because breakfast was about to end. So, you know, priorities. Anyway, enough rambling. Let's go. Let's get something to eat. I'm hungry. Show you something. Should I show him or should I? Should it be a surprise? Yeah. Okay, come on, come with me. This is this is how we're going to celebrate Fourth of July today, right here. Are you ready for this? I saw this this morning, and I thought this is the way. Relaxation is what we need. It's what she needs. She's been working really, really hard. Oh, thank you. And uh, she just needs some time to relax because she's driving all of us. A little. This is how. This is how we're gonna. Right here. Fire pit. Chair. 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 We're gonna sit, relax, and enjoy the weather. Hopefully, if there's some type of fireworks and just each other's company, it's gonna be great. water taxi going and the answer is we don't know that's the fun about having these adventures is that we never know where we're gonna end up it's always somewhere new let's see Look, i'm in line with the stars i'm in sync with the earth ten toes deep flower child from the turf i never switch sides like even when i die i'm a ride for the squad let our ties in the hearse i've been on a vibe kind of hard to describe i'm in between i'm good yeah so we ran into this hotel slash casino and um, it's really nice inside. We were overheating on the boat so we decided to take a break. My wife is all the way over there. What are you doing over here? Why are you coming at me all crazy like that? What are you doing over here? <laughs> the rock is cold. And your bumpies need something nice and cold?
water taxi just arrived to its uh, dock and that's where we're supposed to be and I don't think we're gonna make it there we try to be spontaneous and walk now we gotta try to make it to that boat do you have faith we'll make it we very little I have zero faith okay so we were a little dramatic we made it it's actually the second boat the first boat kind of left, but this one... Yeah, they waited for us. They waited for us. I think they felt bad for us because they saw us running. But we made it. They were like, look at this family breathing. They're going to die. Just, just wait. Just wait for that. It's me, Carlos C, and the Wink. Hi, everybody. I was so lost. It's so hot. Today is a hot one. It's it's a scorcher. It's a hot day. We have not vlogged in like a long time since last well, month. Carlos getting all these new projects all of a sudden. I gotta be honest with you. I'm so busy. Like not busy. I got so much to do that I don't want to do any of it. Have you ever felt that way? That you got so much to do that you're like you just don't even want to start anything just because where do you start that's true and today is another date night Yay. i love date nights i like date nights there well based, oh. if you haven't seen our last vlog. date night that was our last vlog was it our last vlog yeah, that was whoa our last vlog. i planned our last date night we went to a top golf for the first time it was fun a lot of you guys have been wanting to try it. You a guys, lot of you guys, a lot of, a lot of you guys reached out to us saying, "Let's go, let's go." I'll give you all these hands in <laughs> Top Golf, every single piece of these hands. Let's go, let's do it. It it is as much fun as it seems. Is hey, it done? But Chris has a hookup. Oh, that's good. Uh, Chris, hook it up. Chris, we're gonna have to go with you, my guy. Today, my wife is in charge of date night i'm orchestrating we do not tell each other what date night is a surprise every date, every date night is a surprise it's a lot of fun all right so forgot to take the gopro with us Making too much noise. Look at another one. Me and I, Adriana, have been garage sale hunting lately and picking up some items that we can quickly flip for a profit. And we just came up with a Game Boy Advance. We paid $20 for it, came with Mario Kart. We can easily get $75 for it. Um, it's probably an item that I'm gonna sit on for a little bit until somebody gives us the $75. We have a Disney purse that we picked up. This one was like, what, six months ago? It's going for about, how much did you say we saw it for? Which one? The Disney purse. Um, $135. Yeah, so, you know, conservatively, so we'll get about a hundred bucks for it. We paid forty for it. Yeah. Um, Fifteen dollars to get the zipper fixed, and we hope to double our money on that this summer. We definitely want to take advantage of all these garage sales and get, you know, some yeah. stuff that we can make a profit. <sighs> Sad moment. So Carlos, we should be vlogging this. Dramatic pause. <laughs> I have plans and all my plans are outdoors and for our date night for our date night we have I have plans for our date night tonight 
and I just got the alert that it's gonna start raining at 4:41, and all of my plans are outdoors. And it's 4:30 now. And now I'm devastated. I'm trying to figure out real quick, like what else can I possibly do? What else can we switch it to? But it, and my heart's in denial. <laughs> like I don't want to accept the fact that uh, that it may be raining i really really wanted to do this i don't i'm still not gonna tell carlos what it is because i might have to save it for another month i say uh, i say we just risk it because you said it stops raining in two hours right but you know the, the app isn't really as accurate you know? i say if it doesn't rain by 4 45 we just drive there okay all right back home check this out We, it's a tsunami. <laughs> he said at 4:45, if it hadn't started raining, we weren't gonna go. It was 4:41 when it started raining. 4:46 right now. Oh my god! Oh look, it's starting to brighten up a little. I'm telling you, it, it just might. It it looks okay. It looks pretty bad right now. <laughs> it does. It looks pretty Can you bad. See it in camera. Oh yeah. See. This is how Carlos vlogs. This is how. <laughs> All right, so it looks pretty bad right now. It, it our is. date night. <laughs> our date night. I mean, you might say it looks like. <laughs> yeah. That's our, so sad. But we still have hope. We still. It it softens up a little bit now, but it's just. It, like it's not meant to be today so we'll, we're gonna change the plans that I had for today I'm gonna switch them over to another day <laughs> what can I say guys there you have it sorry guys I am extremely sweaty I've been sweaty all day and you're just gonna get a sweaty version of me. I did cool off a little, so I'm thankful if you, for that. Look, Next up. Oh, look, look. Look, it's soft. It's done. What rain? park and there's looks like there's like a festival which is what I love about Chicago you never know where you're gonna find here there's like festivals everywhere all the time like you turn a block and there's the whole streets blocked off because something's yeah, cause happening there's also the Colombian fest going on this weekend so we could have found that one too but we found this one so this one's gonna be it let's see what we let's see what we encounter Colombian fest at Humble Park they trying to take over So that beautiful lady right there decided it was a good idea to put the sushi on my chair and I was trying to get out. Who put this, who put this on my chair? <laughs> eh? Me! I didn't expect you to sit on it. Why you do that? Usually people look before they sit. Well, when I got out the car there was no sushi on my chair. 
But then when you came in, they put the extra sushi that you didn't eat <sighs> after ordering all the rolls. Ooh, that guy just took my parking spot. He's probably super stoked that he found a parking spot. He's like, ooh, I told you we were gonna find one. I told you, see, you're all mad. And we got a spot. <laughs> they probably been looking too for a long time. 